Sarah Jane, we all know how much money you're both going to make. Who has more to lose? Um, probably me. Most likely me. But, you know, I don't focus on that. I focus on going out there, doing my job, and being in my best. Why do you say you have more to lose? I mean, because I, you know, of course, in the in sport of boxing, you know, I've accomplished, you know, a little bit more than Manny has accomplished, but he's a solid, he's a solid competitor. Is it good enough for you to win this fight, or do you have to win it in a certain fashion? Um, I always, of course, you want to win the fight, you know, in great fashion. But you know, it's all about winning at the end of the day. Your uncle Roger says that you're going to knock him out within five rounds. What are your thoughts? Um, we'll just see how the fight play out. You know, my uncle Roger don't have to fight. You know, I have to fight. You know, and we'll just see how everything plays out. How would you compare the hoopla? Coming into this fight, to what there was eight years ago when you were going to fight Oscar De La Hoya at the time, the biggest fight ever in terms of financials. Well, it was totally different, you know, when I faced Oscar De La Hoya, you know, to where he chose, he chose the weight class, he chose the gloves, he chose everything. And um, this is a little different event, you know, a lot bigger now. At 38, are you, at 38, are you the same fighter? Are you a better fighter than you were back then? Um, I'm still a smart fighter. You know, very calculated, you know, um, fighter that's been there before and I know what it takes when it's a fighter of this magnitude. Thank you. Floyd, uh, the fact that you go in there unbeaten and he's got some losses on his record, what impact do you think that will have on the fight? Um, I can't really say what impact it's going to have on the fight. You know, my job is to go out there and be at my best, be smart, be sharp, and do what I do best. In terms of your career, what is this rank as a test? Um, every fight played a major key. You know, um, everyone wants to say um, it's all about one fight. If it, was, if it was all about one fight, all I had to do is just fight one fight in my career, and and then go down as one of, as one of the best by fighting one fight. So every fight played a major key. Floyd, there's a noted lack of animosity in the building. Is it because you both feel you can't break each other down mentally? I mean, I think that you know. The media and different critics may try to make this um, Floyd and Manny Pacquiao a thing where they don't like each other. I don't really know him. I can't. I don't really know him. We never, you know, um, he speaks Tagalog. He speaks a, you know, a totally different language. You know, I speak English. I mean, he speaks a little English, but if I was talking trash to him, he wouldn't know what I was talking about anyway. So, you know, I don't worry about that. I'm a lot older, a lot more mature, so I look at things in a totally different way. You don't have to pretend to dislike, to, to build the kind of animosity within I mean, your I don't have to build this fight like I did in the past. You know, uh, this fight, you know, hope is at its own level, so I don't have to build build this fight up. What does he present that you haven't faced before? I can't really say what he presents because I haven't fought him yet. I could tell you that after the fight, but he's a very exciting fighter. He's a good fighter. Have you watched much on tape? Um, Do you need to? I see him fight, you know, in the past. The last um, probably six years, I'm not really sure. I've really watched him fight. I've probably watched him fight a couple of times, you know, but not, I haven't really watched him, you know, because, you know, when I left Tyrank, I, you know, I tried not to give them my pay-per-view money. I left them to become my own boss, but I don't have any animosity towards uh, Bob Aram and Top Rank, but Mayweather promotions, we are the past, the present, and the future of sports and entertainment. What did your father, and, and what, what has your father and Roger said about what type of challenge you present? Um, they don't have to fight. You know, my dad has done his job. My uncle Roger has done his job. Now it's time for me to go out there and do what I do best. Thank you. Thank you. All right, thank you guys.